after the game. A South Valley man is facing charges after officers found more than $100,000 worth of illegal fireworks in his Hanford home. Police are calling it their biggest illegal fireworks bust in years. Thanks for joining us tonight for Action News After the Game. I'm Warren Armstrong. And good evening, I'm Margot Kim. Authorities say they also found what's known as a practice bomb and homemade fireworks in the home. Action News South Valley reporter Cassandra Gutierrez has more about the dangerous discovery and the punishment the suspect could face. On Thursday, the city of Hanford's police and fire seized over 4,700 pounds of illegal fireworks. The amount of explosives prompted police to evacuate nearby homes. 33-year-old Rion Branch was taken into custody and booked into the Kings County Jail. Branch has a military background and faces multiple felony charges. Police say the street value amounts to over $125,000. Fire Chief Daniel Perkins says it's their biggest bust yet. That is a huge seizure in our general area, and I think it makes a really big statement about how we do not condone any use of any illegal fireworks and remind the public time and time again that in the city of Hanford, we have a zero tolerance. Officers found pallets of fireworks, plus items to make fireworks and a ghost gun. They also found this, an MK-76 practice bomb. Police and fire had multiple agencies assisting, including the bomb squad. Eventually, neighbors were cleared to return home, and the fireworks were removed from the property. Once these are out around and people are using illegal fireworks, they're extremely dangerous. In the state of California, every single year, there's over a million dollars worth of property damage caused directly by illegal fireworks. Hanford Police Chief Stephanie Huddleston says most times illegal fireworks are brought in across state lines. Local fines can cost up to $1,000. But in this case, Branch could be facing a hefty fine and jail time. That when we say we will not tolerate illegal fireworks, we mean that. So for those individuals that are planning to use or sell these dangerous fireworks, just so you know, we are watching and we will take action to enforce these laws. The Hanford Police Department will be on a legal fireworks patrol from now through the 4th of July. They say their goal this summer is to keep the community safe. In Hanford, I'm Cassandra Gutierrez, ABC 30 Action News.